And good morning! Today from Marbella, and it's not just any good morning. It is the two-year anniversary of this vlog. But before we move on to that, I think we need to pick up in Soldem where we left off. So let's check back in Soldem. We'll be right back to Marbella. I kind of suspected that I was not going to feel too good today, but I'm actually more sore than I actually expected. I would almost compare this to like day two after an ACL surgery. I'm so slow, I have to ask Benny for help with everything. My thumb hurts, I can't even type on my phone, and everything hurts. So no skiing means a different set of plans. So the next mission was for us to grab a few photos of the newly introduced, redefined edition of the douchebags, our latest limited edition. You know we like the red stripes? It's matching. We figured that why not do a design that kind of uh, goes in, in those directions. Exactly. So this was launched yesterday when this vlog is coming out. But mine and Benny's plan was to grab a bunch of photos. Now we realized it's 12.15, flight leaves in four and a half hours, yeah. and it takes three hours and 15 minutes from Selden at the bottom. It's way too late. So very late, but it was productive to get some shots. But now we got to really, really run. In the car. So we'll see at the airport and hopefully we'll be okay with that. And we made it. <laughs> yep. Waking up with a sore body in Solden and then I realized that we needed to make a couple quick calls on the house in Marbella so if I'm broken I can't ski. Nothing wrong with the flight in the exactly. afternoon. So hectic life continues and now it's time to fly to Richard and just enjoy Marbella for maybe a day, two, three, however long we stay. Cheers. Marbella! Casa de Lero, our temporary residence while we have a construction zone down at our place. But now that we made it up here, I see that we can just spin straight to present time. Because I hope this little uh, segment showed our quick decision travel plans the way we are. And we are tired. <laughs> oh, okay, just. Oh! Hello. And spin to now. <laughs> So that's how we made it back to Marbella and uh, Hotel Ricard Delier is treating us real nicely because as you know we have a full-on construction zone down at Casa Castle. But that is not what we're going to talk about today. We're going to talk about the year that has passed because I think the vlogs when we look over what we've actually done in a year are the best. So I say we take it from the start and look through the best parts of the year. So we started the year off right with some surfing in Mexico. Then we jumped on a flight, went to LA to visit Riley, Sammy, Sammy and Michaela. Style. Yeah. Then we flew to the colder part of the world and visited my brother. Bonjour. Good morning. Or do I get to get to do the official good morning? And reunited with my family. <laughs> on cross country skis. <laughs> yes. So back again. Should we really post this? <laughs> and then I broke my rib. Hey! Hey! Oi, oi, oi. Uh, is it medicine? Yeah, good medicine. And me and Benny became the subject of a rescue mission. They are coming straight this way. It's like a rescue boat. Really? And Benny got to try skis for the first time. <laughs> <laughs> then back to Stockholm and fully dressed up in a tuxedo. Whoa. <laughs> <laughs> Perfect, 100%. Bought my first medium format camera. Tack så mycket. Tack så mycket. Listen. Yeah. And then we flew to Kalmar to do the Wings for Life. <laughs> With a broken rib. Oh! <laughs> and then back home for a bit. The sun, the heat, and the French Riviera. And then a longer flight over to Turks and Caicos and the Revolve shoot with Yanni. Benny, I'm truly sorry that I didn't bring you on this trip. My biggest apologies. And then back to Monaco again and got ourselves a serious water housing. Oh, you drop it directly like this? Then I introduce myself. My name is Benjamin Robert Francois Ortega. And then I got the opportunity to try the Bugatti Chiron. Like, hello. And what's a year without a bit of Monaco Grand Prix? But we got the track right over there. Where we got to check out the biggest boats in the world. And then back to Marbella and raced around in the Camel Golf cart. <laughs> wow. Got myself a new watch as well. Audemars Piguet Royal Oak 39 millimeter skeleton rose gold. And Ricardo bought this new place. Which we love. 
and then a quick trip to Norway for the douchebag board meeting. <laughs> And next up was a bit of Marbella time. <laughs> Good morning! <laughs> and you know that summer has started once you can take the boat out and do some wake yeah. surfing behind it. <laughs> And George DeRolls arrived. And then Benny threw a cockroach on the girls when we we're trying to have a meeting. <laughs> and then a quick little flight to Budapest to get to experience the Red Bull Air Race planes. That was crazy. And then one of the highlights of the year, taking Richard's boat from Marbella all the way to Ibiza yes! or Formentera. And once in Ibiza, we got to play with a lot of toys. One, three, two, one. <laughs> And on the way back to Marbella, we got to see a million more dolphins. Oh, they're going crazy! It's like a million of them! Oh! It's insane! But they're just in there! Yeah! Yes! Yeah! Look at him! Here, here, here! Under! No way! Yes! And we got to risk our drone a bit. And once the boat arrived to Marbella, we jumped straight on a flight to Boston, where we played some volleyball and hung out with the family and just had a good time. And then I joined Gianni on a trip to the Hamptons in New York, where we announced we are putting the house up for sale. And next up was Alexandra joining me as Hola. my better half in organizing myself. Thanks a million, Alexandra, for making my life a million times better. And next up was a wedding in Norway for my good friend Leif. And then we rolled around Monaco a bit with the Batmobile causing total chaos. You guys look really normal! <laughs> and we got to see Benny's parents' place for the first time. And I had the best birthday ever, getting kidnapped and flown in a helicopter. So no idea where you're going. And no. Cheers. Cheers. Cheers, guys. I got to ride with Nico Rosberg around the F1 track in Monaco, hearing all the secrets of the current Formula One world champion. Anymore, you know? yeah. And then you, on the way back, with the wheel spin coming at the same time. And me and Benny got to hang out backstage at a fashion store in Stockholm with Yanni. I think Benny liked that one. Yeah, good. See you soon. See you. See you out there. Have fun and smile. And then we went on an adventure mission up to Östersund. We drove three people on a sled on water, we flipped quad wheelers, we flew a helicopter, and I got to try my first drift car with 900 horsepower. And George was sold last night. No! And 2017 was the first time me and Benny got to experience Emirates business class to Bali. Wonderful. <laughs> Cheers. Cheers. And once we arrived in Bali, we had the most amazing trip. We got to see manta rays, we got to surf a bunch, but most importantly, I got a lot in Lombok to build my own dream villa. Welcome, Jon, to Tampa Hills, the Seaside Society. Straight from Bali, all the way to New York. <laughs> and then all the way back to Europe to meet up with Yanni in Milan. Carl, what's up? Life is good. And then we thought we hadn't traveled enough, so we flew back to San Francisco for the GoPro launch What's event happening? of the Hero 6, where I also got to try the Porsche 918. 
And then back across the Atlantic to Marbella, where I got to play with an all carbon fiber top car Porsche 911. And then it was time for one of the other highlights of the year. Ready. Always ready. <laughs> Going to Colombia to build a school with Richard and Delair Mollery. That was just by far the best trip of my life. And then, of course, the biggest thing of the year. And hopefully she will say yes. Me having the guts to finally ask Yanni to marry her. <laughs> And it's crazy, now when I look at this again, I'm like, it's so weird to film that, but I'm so happy that I, I can experience that again and again and again. Sorry, quick break, we're trying to find no wind here. See, I love these videos the most, because it's the only time when I actually understand how much of a crazy life we have. This should be better, right? Perfect, what was next? It was time to introduce Lord And then a quick little trip to LA, since Yanni had some work to do there. Yay! And I'm not the one to say no to a bit of syrup. I think so. And then another highlight, back in Marbella and introducing our new Casa Castle. Yeah. Wow. That is now a crazy construction zone. Flying to Hong Kong and trying a Formula E car for the very first time. And then back to the Riviera racing skateboards with Benny. Probably not the smartest thing of the year, but the most fun was cutting the roof off the Jeep. Yo, what's up? <laughs> I've always wanted a very special car. And we spent Christmas in Sweden with my family, which was incredible. I love your food, mom. And then it was time for some adventures in Morocco. Two, one, happy! Oh, happy million subscribers! <laughs> And we got the house painted down here in Marbella. And now, what? And then it was ice drifting time in Norway. And meeting up with Marcus again for the first time in a long time. Ah, hey! Yeah, I'm a <laughs> Sorry, I'm... And then I had my first real break since I started vlogging. A week in Tulum, just chilling with Yanni, which was the best trip in history of the world. But then I was back to full speed mode again, flying to Santiago, <laughs> meeting up with Benny there. Benny! Oh! And checking out the Formula E race. And then from Santiago, we flew up to Atlanta and over to Tokyo to find the best powder in the world. And then it was time to try the Emirates first class suites. Two showers. And then it was time to introduce Phoenix the RS6. We continue the full speed mode, driving up to Livigno, doing some heli skiing, which was sick by the way, and drifting Lambos in the afternoon. And then a quick little trip to Dubai. Cool. It was. Very, very cool. And then from the sand dunes to the Italian Alps in Kronplatz, where we got to experience one of the best heli rides in a long time, and I got to do some flips. We started breaking walls in the renovation here in Marbella. And then it was time to surf again. This time it was over in Sri Lanka, which was a first time for us, but I can already recommend this place to everyone. And then just a mellow flight home. So that we could meet up with a few of you guys on the way up to Aura for the Red Bull home run. Yes! And Johnny turned 28. And then it was time to do some highway racing with the Italian police. And then it was looping time in Solda. <laughs> and now we're back to reality again. 
That is crazy when you look at it that way. Bam. <laughs> The biggest, biggest, biggest thank you to Benjamin Ortega for having the energy to keep up with this insane schedule. Uh, hold on. There we go. We need to ask Mr. Benny, name your top three oh, things yeah. of the year. First, creating the school in Colombia because it was the, the most touching experience I've ever lived. Uh, going to Sri Lanka for the first time. Number three, going on a sled on water. If you had to pick two more. I mean, everything is so nice. It's so hard to just pick like, to just pick one of them. Uh, I would say surfing. We've been surfing so much, but I would say, no, Mentares, Mentares in Bali. First time seeing Mentares that this big and this close uh, from me. And uh, last one would be living, cruising on a boat towards Ibiza with the best people ever. That's a good choice. And you? Easy first one. Yeah. I got engaged with Yanni. Buying a house with Yanni is such a big thing that it has to come in second, even though it's not like a wow. And then building uh, the school in Colombia yeah. would be a number three. So I guess that kind of sums up the uh, this video. I hope you guys enjoy this. Don't worry, we will be back with uh, renovation update status. We can just say that it's chaos down there. And then to end the whole thing with what's the plan for the future? No plan. We enjoy what we're doing and we're going to keep doing it. But yeah, nothing else than that, right? Exactly. Well, yeah, we like it. Hope if you guys continue watching, we'll continue to create. Thanks Bye. a million for watching, and you know, don't forget to subscribe. We like that stuff. Ciao, ciao. Over now. Damn it! There was one very, very important detail that I forgot. From now on, season three, we're gonna be posting at 8 p.m. Central European time instead of 4 p.m. because that sometimes when we travel gives us a little more time. And I think more people actually have time to watch it at 8 p.m. So four hours later than, than in the past, same days, Tuesday, Thursday, Sunday. And I think that was everything. So I hope, hope that sounds good. Yeah. Over now. Ciao. Ciao. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> That's horrible.